Thanks for tuning in. Previously, I had covered in a video how to get uh, the televideo stream using Python. Most recently, we've been testing, figuring out how to get uh, the stream in drone blocks uh, using Swift code, and just been on this relentless path to really understand uh, how to get access to the video stream. It's easy to enable the stream using the Tello SDK with the stream on command, but that's sort of where the uh, easiness stops, then there's the decoding of the stream. So I've put together this project that I'm going to uh, share a link to GitHub below in the video description as well as demonstrate how it works. And my goal really was to try to find the simplest way with the least amount of code uh, to be able to get access to the stream in your web browser. Now, uh, this is actually less than 100 lines of code if we don't include the comments and the repository has all the documentation. You're, obviously, you're going to need Node.js installed. Uh, the other dependency is FFmpeg that will handle grabbing the video stream and then uh, forwarding that to uh, Node.js. So let's take a quick look at the code. I won't bore you with all the details. Make sure to follow the link and, and look at it yourself. So the main components are a, a web server that allows us to access uh, the app through the web browser. Then there is a, a streaming server. This is what FFmpeg is going to send the video stream to. And when there's a connection, it will send that uh, data to the WebSocket server. And the WebSocket uh, server is here in step three. That's basically uh, broadcasting the video stream to all the connected clients, which will be uh, web clients. And then finally, we just uh, make sure that we send the command and stream on SDK commands to Tello. That will begin putting Tello in the video stream mode. And if you're not aware, those are going to be these constants here. This is the Tello IP, Tello port. And then finally, we'll just delay three seconds before we begin FFmpeg. And what that will do is it will grab the stream which is coming in via UDP on this port. And this will work with both Tello and Tello EDU. That stream is then forwarded to our stream server that we defined right here. And then we'll be able to access this stream through the browser. Oh yeah, one more thing. I want to make sure to not overlook this because this project wouldn't be possible without this uh, JSMPEG uh, JavaScript decoder. So that's actually included here in our web page that we'll be accessing uh, here in just a second. And that project, I put a link to it in the uh, GitHub readme. It exists at this URL and uh, just very thankful this exists because it certainly simplified this whole process. I've gone ahead and cloned the repo. This is just uh, the code that I've downloaded and run locally. The first thing you'll want to do after you install Node and FFmpeg is run the npm install command. So the next thing we'll do is, this is very important, uh, make sure that you power up Tello before you try to run this script. So I'm currently powering up Tello and we'll want to connect to the Tello or Tello EDU Wi-Fi network. Here it is in the list, I'll go ahead and select it. We'll give that just a few seconds to connect. And the last thing we wanna do is run node on the index.js file, that's the main application. So it's running, and what we'll do now is I'll go and open a web browser. We'll go to localhost, I believe if I recall 3000, uh, index.html, and there's our stream. So let me just show you, it's actually, pretty good as it relates to uh, latency. So I'm going to have, you can see uh, my main mouse here and then the broadcast mouse on the screen from the video feed. So we're sort of in that picture in picture uh, view, but I'm going to just move my mouse. And there's just about, I'd say less than a second of delay. I find it fairly acceptable just for uh, testing purposes. And let me just leave you with a little bonus. Uh, if you are a Node-RED user, we've figured out how to do this and I'm not going to take much credit here. This is a, a node developed by a couple developers in the Node-RED community. 
It's the FF Impact Stream. It will support both Tello and Raspberry Pi. You can see that it'll support either there. But I have Tello connected, and let me just demonstrate. I'm going to issue the command sequence. I'll send the stream on, and then we'll go to the actual view here. I might need to refresh, and this is actually running uh, in Node-RED. So super cool stuff to be able to integrate uh, video in a web browser through standard Node as well as Node.js. Uh, the flow for the Node-RED example that I just showed is in this repository. You can see the link here. And I'll put uh, all of these in the description below if you guys want to check it out and give it a test. If you guys have any questions or comments, please post them below. And until next time, thanks for watching.